from the north reaching out across the world you are watching the Kofi Assam <laughs> channel this is a goblin in the shape of Kofi <laughs> <coughs> and that one's Sam <laughs> and if you're here then you are welcome hello everybody <laughs> welcome along to the stream I hope you're excited to get back into the mystery of Sonic it's such a mystery. It's definitely not the train conductor who's one day from retirement and clearly wearing a mask. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, but think... we're having a blast with it. Um, yeah. I hope uh, it's been a little <laughs> bit of a break, but I hope I hope you guys remember what was going on. We, um, I feel like we eliminated Amy as a suspect. Knuckles. Oh, we called Bingus. I forgot we were called Bingus. Bingus, Bingus <laughs> Library. Bingus, Bingus H Library. <laughs> because they wouldn't let us type in the word shingles. Right. Um, which is, of course, Bingus's first name. Bingus is a middle name. Um, but I think we've eliminated um, Espio and Vector as suspects. Knuckles gave us some trouble because of something, something Super Monkey Ball. Um, but yeah, I think we're just going through this really well-equipped train. Train murder mystery. Do you remember who was playing Bingus? Uh, you were playing Bingus in your most earnest voice. Too many locked doors to worry about, but I'm glad everything straightened itself out in the end. Well... I'm exhausted. I'm going to crash here for a bit. These chairs are so comfy. <laughs> I don't remember Espio's voice at all. Uh, Likewise. Wait, no. Oh, yep. Was Espio not... Um, oh, Gil Espio was Gilbert Gottfried! <laughs> 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 I forgot. Likewise, <laughs> I could use a breather. Yeah, watch, watch the... Um, Watch the video from the last one to <laughs> see Sam Rees, the best poetry in the best voice. <laughs> I hate my tail's voice, but here goes. Sadly, our work isn't done. I have plenty of questions for Rouge and especially Shadow. Don't trust that guy. Oh, it seems the door to the next car is open. Amy must have kept it open when she passed through earlier. Then that's our cue to leave. See you later, Vector and SBO, when we come back to arrest you. Give them heck, and if you need any meat chopped up, say the word. I'll keep my poetry sharp for both of you. Um, A murderer <laughs> is on the loose, <laughs> okay. while doors <laughs> keep getting locked. Tick, tock, tock, goes the clock. While our heroes are in the caboose. No, because we're going towards the front of the train, right? Also, why is he so happy about just <laughs> writing impromptu poetry about... His friend is dead. Like, really dead. Nobody cares. Oh, my God. Chat are reminding us that earlier on in the story, Vector and SBO did go into the library to fuck. It yeah. was very clear. Very obvious. Um, um, of course, Vector did get bored <laughs> and wander <laughs> off to play Super Monkey Ball with Knuckles. So, uh... <laughs> At this point, I'm feeling pretty confident in our detective abilities. We're really doing this. <laughs> we are re Come on, Bingus. Let's see what's next. Boy, are we doing this. Coming! Just like Espio and Vector were <laughs> earlier. <laughs> uh, I was expecting you to go there, but it was still funny when you did. You sure you don't want to stay and look at all the great books a little longer? Look at those big puppy dog eyes. The mystery calls. I, I feel like the mystery calls, the but mystery why are they calls. asking us? <laughs> like... It seems suspicious. Well, because they don't know that we've been in this room for two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> you know? It's time to move on. Okay. The investigation continues. Slow fade out. 
Ooh. The casino car? I suppose every Sonic game has a casino level, different. like that casino in the middle of an uncharted jungle we found. This isn't very different from the saloon car, but... like That's true. <laughs> that, is, that is true. It's just the Sonic vibe. Oh, My this stuff's getting heavy. I'll dump what I don't need. Rouge, there you are. We have a lot to say to you. <laughs> we visited every train car so far and everyone said they've seen you wandering about. It's high time you told us why. How dare you have legs and walk around? My, my. Talk about a warm welcome. Quick to the point, aren't you, darling? <sighs> and I see you brought the microwave master with you. <sighs> <laughs> oh, please don't let that be my legacy. Tails um, Flowers is, right. is calling back to the desalted nuts that someone had licked <laughs> in the in the, um, in the other car. <laughs> Tails is right. Folks have brought you up a lot. Care to explain? <sighs> Um, I I don't know. You like, don't know. I, I scarcely remember that Blaze the cat exists. She's a cat, by the way. I don't know whether you knew that. <laughs> it's it's not very obvious. It's, it's not easy to tell. <laughs> I mean, um, I think it's easier to tell that Rouge is a bat, but there's not a lot in it. <laughs> okay. Yep. Yeah, I I you you did say um, Blaze is a cat, and I was like. But they're both cats, right? Rouge has got bat wings. Look at her bat wings. I had to look I don't quite know how close many times to see I the bat to say wings. This. I had to look quite close to see the bat wings. <laughs> um, tell them, Rouge, we're gonna need the help. You know what? That's that's good. Blaze. All right. I've been hunting for a treasure room to be stored here on the train. It's Bingus's virginity. <laughs> <laughs> Treasure? They certainly didn't tell me about my virginity in the interview. <laughs> Since I'm part business tycoon, part purveyor of fine collectibles, I knew you had to find it. <laughs> tell him what it is, Rouge. <laughs> All right. Well. It's a Fabergé chow egg. Wow, that does sound extravagant. But please don't tell me you accepted Amy's birthday invite only to find that egg. I've always hated that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> a woman can have multiple goals. I gave Amy her birthday present already. So everything's well taken care of. What's the birthday present killing Sonic? <laughs> Just because just that's out that's the, way. the gift that keeps that's, giving. That I'm is the lie. gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> she wrote me in on the hunt immediately. I stayed here while she searched the train class for clues. I deduced that the Fabazé Chow egg is here in this train car, locked in a safe. Is there a safe here? Because <laughs> <laughs> that will. Wait. Why is there an elevator? That's an <laughs> elevator behind Tails. Why is there an elevator? Look, you've never like, been built underground into the on a train. Side wall of the train. You've never been Where underground on a train. If you open those doors, would there be an <laughs> elevator in there? Or would you just fall out onto the track? Where is this going? Kofi, have you never been on on an elevator underground into a train? <laughs> no. <laughs> because that doesn't exist. <laughs> and it shouldn't exist. It's dumb. <laughs> Wait, so <laughs> the treasure is real? It's actually here? And what did you manage to find, Rouge? Oh, well, why don't you both take a look? <laughs> a blueprint. I found the train's blueprints in the library car with the safe code written right on it. The score of a lifetime. 
The train's blueprints? Please, Rouge, let me see that! Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, finders keepers, sweetheart. There's a problem. We need your assistance. What kind of problem? The elevator behind the security guard leads us right to the room <laughs> holding the Fabergé Chow egg. Sorry, now I'm imagining the, the Oh my god, that's a security guard with the frumpy little mustache <laughs> and the <laughs> the aviator shades. I thought that was like a vase or something. That's a little guy. <laughs> it's just a little guy. Um No, I I love to imagine that, you know, it, it just goes out through that door into a room. Um except <laughs> this train's been moving along the tracks and it's just been <laughs> smashed off <laughs> by a pylon on the side of the tracks. Every time the train runs, they have to build a new room. <laughs> <laughs> but we're not getting anywhere without that Chow Ned Flanders <laughs> access card. <laughs> we, need to get a we need a plan to get that card to use the elevator and our chance of success grows with everyone's help. So, you want us to help you steal the Fabergé Chow Egg? I think that's against his employee code of conduct, right? <laughs> Blaze, you don't have a problem with this? I see no issues here. Sounds like a fine business venture. Ah, oh, her law card must be influencing her decisions here. Yeah, she's not evil. She's just acting in character. Either that or... Breaking the rules must be refreshing for a princess. Bingus, do you have an opinion on this? Hint, hint. It's time for a five-finger discount. Well, I suppose if both Blaze and Bingus are in, <laughs> crime really is okay. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> let's go get that Fabergé chow egg, a thing that really exists. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry, but Chill Tails is so susceptible to peer pressure. Yeah. It, it took two people going. Turns out yeah, he's a not. literal kid. <laughs> <laughs> Heh, that's the ticket. Happy to have you both on the team. Now, we must plan. They're planning right in front of the security guards. <laughs> yeah, but it's definitely just a doll. In fairness, the security doll, guard doesn't have so ears. So. It's, it's just a doll. <laughs> oh boy, what have we gotten ourselves into? Just because I agreed to do theft. <laughs> Access to the Fabergé Chow Egg room is behind a locked elevator door. The security guard has the access card. Do we? Attack the guard, bribe the guard, distract the guard, choose violence. Choose violence? Choose violence every time. I can't say I'm comfortable attacking a chow. Let's keep violence to a minimum, shall we? A hedgehog has just died. <laughs> Less fun, but I agree. Let's think about it again. Access to the Fabergé, we said this. The illusion of choice. <laughs> uh, bribe the guard, right? Anyone have anything we can use for a bribe? I have a pair of tweezers. Oh, here's a trading card. I'm not giving you anything. Maybe bribing isn't the way to go. <laughs> Distract them. Perfect. We're all charming enough for that to work. That was actually a really nice thing to say. Bingus, is everything okay? I've never seen you smile like that. Seems they don't know how to take a compliment. Sorry, is it wrong to smile when someone compliments <laughs> you? Yes. <laughs> You're supposed to go, You've fuck been doing you. it wrong your whole life. <laughs> I mean, if you're British, like, going, fuck you, <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's pretty right. Not going to lie. <laughs> if I'm going to be uh, in a casino, my poker face needs work. Okay, who's distracting the security guards? I mean, it's definitely Rouge. Of course I'll distract them. Who could resist my feminine charms? <laughs> 
Um, something something tits. Yep. <laughs> I'm not sure how effective your charms will be on a chow. Plus, your flight might prove useful. You're in a train. I'm not sure Why you being the you distraction makes sense. <laughs> oh, well, fair enough. Let's think it over again. <laughs> Let's go with Tails, the least charismatic <laughs> of them all. <laughs> sure, I could be the distraction. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the way he said that, Vito. It's just gone. <laughs> I'm with Blaze. His delivery was shaking. No, really, I could do it. Sorry, buddy, but I think you'd be better off elsewhere. <laughs> <laughs> it's always the last option. In my life, I've never let a single person down. I won't falter. Good. Great! Her voice was so stoic. I have chills. Well, I trust her. Moving on. What's the distraction? <laughs> oh, you definitely asked the chat about their partner and kids. Right? Like. Oh, wow. Straight. That was the Excellent. right answer. People Amazing. love talking about themselves. This will easily distract the guard. Perfect. I think we can move on then. With the guard distracted, <laughs> um, Rouge, how will you get the access card? Um, cosh him on the back of the head. <laughs> uh, <laughs> grab them and fly up to the rafters. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want any violence. <laughs> there won't be any violence. I'll just tie them up to a rafter. Easy. Where do we get the rope? Um, interesting point. Maybe we should try something else. Uh, ah, just, just ask nicely. <laughs> Works nine times out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No promises. With the card obtained, we need to get Blaze out of there. Bingus, what's your plan? Uh, pretend you're Blaze's spouse. That's really going to be awkward for him. <laughs> <laughs> then you'd be marrying into the royal family. What's your heritage? Look, look at her expression. This is just like, oh, this again. I get this every fucking day. <laughs> Any war crimes I should know about? What? What? Well, I, um, I, I, I did once, uh, do some drone strikes. <laughs> You dress far too plain. You would need a complete refashioning immediately. And a gold-plated microwave. Uh, you know what? Maybe we should try something else. <laughs> Interesting. You give up far too easily as well. We'd have to work on I your I think fortitude. Blaze is secretly into this. <laughs> I, I, I said we'd try something else. <sighs> Push the security guard up. <laughs> Oh my god, what level of violence is hey, like... Hey, you're such a fucking spoil sport. I'm still sport. not comfortable with any violence here. You're such a spoil sport. I mean, we kill Dr. Eggman every day, but... <laughs> 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 but if they start crying, it brings unwanted attention to us. Why is someone who cries so easily a security guard? Decent point. Let's think of something else. Ah... <sighs> Say there's a drink. That's not That's absolutely vile. I can think of nothing worse. Why would a security car bother with a drink without a coaster? He's not a... I, That's no. Bingus's job, not the security guard's job. A bartender wouldn't even care. Like, come on. Despicable. I would never allow such a thing in my kingdom. The guard will go running immediately. I'm sure of it. I know. Uh... That, that definitely makes sense. Great, and with the guard distracted, we'll all head to the elevator. Wait, I thought this was how to get them out of the elevator on the way back. Are we still... We've not even made it to the elevator we've, at this point in the plan. We've not even made oh, it to the elevator. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is this so convoluted? <laughs> Why are we planning a heist? We're solving our friend's murder. Um, victory a cappella. Now that's a proper victory. 
Oh no, one last secret measure we didn't account for. What do we do about the mechanical arms <laughs> attacking from the ceiling? Uh, high five them. <laughs> the end of those arms are claws. <laughs> <laughs> My high fives aren't given away willy nilly. They are to be cherished. To sound fair. I don't think my hands would survive a high five from them. They humoured my suggestion. How <laughs> oddly polite of them. <laughs> um. Up to you. Up to you. I should be able to disengage them. I'll just need some time. Well, that leads us nicely to our next question. Oh no, Tails is taking a while and the arms are tightening their grip. It's actually quite nice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um. oh no. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, I don't know. There's no good answer to this. Why are they rolling? Tails managed to do it. Darlings, I'm happy to say this plan is perfect. If everybody is ready, it's time to execute. I'm ready. Let's begin. All right. Let's see what's up that elevator. <laughs> but so let's watch off this the side of a train. <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> We're not going to see the plan. I knew the plan would go off without a hitch. <laughs> We couldn't have made it this far without you both. You have my gratitude. Our planning beforehand was very thorough, I must admit, and it was executed to perfection. <laughs> Luckily, off screen. Enough chatter. Now we claim our real prize. I have the safe code right here on these blueprints. Let's claim our Fabergé Chow Egg. I mean my Fabergé Chow Egg. We're not going to subdivide it. That would be destroying art. No question, this has got to be the safe with our treasure. On it, sweetheart. Let's see. 2304. Oh, the release date of this game. Oh. 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 April Fool's Day. What was in the other safe? We'll never know. We'll never know. We'll never know. We'll never know. It's, it's Sonic's body. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, it's just the magical cure for Sonic's death. <laughs> What's the bet that the Fabergé Chow Egg is the murder weapon, though? Like, he was Ooh. bludgeoned with it. Oh, I quite like that. It's here. Ha ha ha. I have it. All right, before anyone sees us, let's get out of the... Hold on, kiddo. We can't be so hasty. You truly think that that's all there is to this egg? We need to wash it in bleach, stat. <laughs> <laughs> no further secrets whatsoever. Rouge, spit it out. What are you hiding? Only three of these eggs were ever made, each hiding their own individual secret. No one knows the secret, because <laughs> anyone who's opened one of these has never lived to tell the tale. I'm sorry, what? The tales. <laughs> <laughs> Someone Kinder has... surprise with Sonic's body. <laughs> <laughs> Love to imagine he has oh just teleported God. inside the egg. <laughs> it's the death egg. <laughs> you can open the egg? You sure can, and all of you will bear witness to its secret. And I all mean, its secret of you shall bear witness. <laughs> 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 Rouge, I don't know if you should. I, 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 I think it's gonna kill us all. <laughs> all you need to do is twist it. It's not very secret, is it? Uh, it's a bomb? Or is it just an egg timer? <laughs> Absolutely an egg timer, It's the right? number of seconds left until Sonic bleeds out. <laughs> we did actually ascertain that he had expired. Just that he was on the floor bleeding. That's true. We, we... Uh-oh. 
Like, yeah, no one has gone, <laughs> Sonic needs medical attention. Rouge? Has no one lived to tell the egg secrets? Because each egg is a bomb. Mm. <clears throat> that very Yoda <laughs> exclamation. <laughs> I think you're onto something, kid. It sure sounds like a bomb. Isn't this exciting? <laughs> uh, I think maybe we should eat that egg now. <laughs> <laughs> if only this train had windows. <laughs> <laughs> Dispose of it after all our hard work. This is how the other eggs kill wood. <laughs> 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 this, is, this is how... The other <laughs> ex killed everyone because everyone went, oh, oh no, it'll just be an egg timer. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Fine, fine, but what do we do? Where do I put this thing? That's an excellent question. What do we do? What about, what just do we do with give the it to Tails. <laughs> give it to Tails. Oh my God. <laughs> Um, I'm in favor of rock the egg to sleep. <laughs> Let Rouge kiss the egg. Let Tails cool it down with his tail. So you think this egg is just cranky and needs a nap? Is that what you're telling us? We've got to try all of these. Everyone's always mad at the idea guy. Let Tails cool it down with his tails. <laughs> Stop Let on him the egg. Finish take one. What does take what one happens? for the team mean? <laughs> <laughs> Here, give it to me. <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Get as far away from me as possible. Just. <laughs> just remember oh me god. as I am a, a hero and. And if they want to put me on a coin, tell them to use a picture of the young Bingus. Unfortunately, they don't have coins, they have rings. <laughs> oh, no, Bingus, we won't let you do that. I mean, if that's what they want to do, who are we to? <laughs> Stop the microwave, kids. Obviously not going to sacrifice themselves. Their body's far too scrawny con to contain any sort of blast. True. <laughs> Let's think of something else, quickly. <laughs> Eat it. <laughs> 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 Not without any salt, I won't. Really, Bingus? Probably a poor time for jokes. Huh? I think he was being serious. He's just trying to save <laughs> <Yeah>. face. <laughs> Let Rouge kiss the egg. Has Rouge kissed the egg already? It's as they say, love always prevails. <laughs> I still hear the ticking. The... <laughs> Do you? No, that must be in my imagination. We're fine now. It's it's definitely stopped. Hmm. What a prude. Um. I actually think Chaos Control the Egg Away might be the answer because Shadow will be oh the no, next person we think. But like, I don't want to skip to it's these and lock in not the see safe, these right? amazing things. I think it's either Chaos Control the Egg Way or let it finish ticking and see what happens. Because I don't think it's a bomb. I think it's an egg timer. Are you insane? Do you want us to just blow up? We need to dispose of the bomb, Bingus. <laughs> that is our goal. L l listen, I get, I get that, but with the egg isn't a bomb. <laughs> Wait, that's right. Bingus, I think you're onto something. You just killed us all. <laughs> huh? What's <laughs> right? Spit it out, kiddo. We don't have any time. Sorry, it's just Espio did say something interesting when we quizzed him about the train's manual. Okay, um... What efficient and extremely accurate technology was installed to assist in keeping the train spotless? Robotic arms! During events, they can perform a variety of tasks and are responsible for cleaning up trash and messes afterwards. 
The robotic arms can also detect weapons or explosives being brought onto the train, ensuring passenger safety. Which means that Sonic was definitely murdered with an improvised weapon. But I had to take a moment. I need to apologize to chat because I didn't hold my can of Pepsi up to the microphone to open it and <laughs> was immediately called out by multiple people. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry. I sincerely. Next time I'll, um, I'll make it up to you. Okay. Uh, one second. <laughs> can we make a bottle? Oh, this ASMR? is gonna go. Oh, this could go so wrong. Last stream, everyone. Thank you for coming. <laughs> <laughs> Our equipment is ruined. <laughs> Speaking of, it's so nice. It's sad that we don't have Tim with us, but like, it's so nice to have a sane amount of equipment on this desk. Because <laughs> last week yeah. was yeah, no, it was mental. A bit, yeah, um, it was <laughs> just a forest of wires and microphones. I really um, hope chat appreciated that because now my coke will just be flat. <laughs> oh yeah, like it's it's uh, yeah you scored an own goal, but like there's a lot of, there's a lot of gratitude there in the chats. Like people people like that. You've um you've oh, redeemed yeah. you've redeemed oh, yeah. the stream. Um, redeem you've the redeem, stream. Redeem the stream. Um, <laughs> Those robot arms that attacked us in the elevator seem to have a lot of functions here on the train. If a bomb was brought onto the train disguised as this Fabergé chow egg, the arms would have detected it, and it wouldn't have allowed it on. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> the only other person who knows the coming and going of the train is the conductor, and surely, 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 surely... <laughs> <laughs> He's he wouldn't definitely allow a good guy. anything bad Only to good happen. guys appear out of nowhere, drop dark hints to their employees about taking care <laughs> of the passengers, and go far ha ha at any opportunity. Also, does that sentence imply that the conductor is the only person who knows the train's timetable? Because that's very dangerous. <laughs> I love that. You this. have to have plans. <laughs> I just love the idea that the signal people just no idea. <laughs> you have to file <laughs> plans. <laughs> so, if we're out of options, I think we should wait and see what happens. It's probably um, fine. We're probably not going to die. I've been in denial this whole time since I saw a corpse. Chat has got a crazy theory um, that the conductor is too busy getting rails to care. Oh, I don't remember the conductor getting rails. The conductor rails, was but... fucking the train. We, oh, we, we established that okay. the that, conductor that was definitely fucking the train. In a very train. literal sense, getting rails. <laughs> um, good, good for him. Good for him. <laughs> Who doesn't love getting rails sometimes? <laughs> okay, we wait. Uh, okay. Oh, what, we, the egg, it opened. It's hollow. Not a bomb at all. You both really were onto something. Phew! <laughs> my, my, well, that's one way to get the heart racing. I'm completely relieved. My hunch was right. That, thankfully, this, this isn't just a delusional dream that I'm having because I, I'm I'm very traumatized by seeing a corpse. <laughs> e and look what's inside. <laughs> e bag. You can't say inside. that. You can't say that sentence not in a Yorkshire accent. E and look <laughs> what's inside. <laughs> Is it rings? Is it rings? It's a chow. Because it's a chow egg. Wow, look at that sparkle. And it's so heavy too. The final secret to the Fabergé chow egg is a chow covered in... Those aren't gems. Those are 
rhinestones at best. <laughs> it's perfect. I think it's they're sequins. exquisite. It's revolutionary. Is she drooling over a sparkly ornament? No, I must admit it is stunning. Sorry, he was talking about her drool. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, that's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> it's one thing to talk about the conductor getting railed. <laughs> <laughs> but it's another thing. But you've for crossed the line to get, there. <laughs> to get a little overexcited <laughs> about Rouge's drawl. You said no one lived to tell the tale at the Fabergé Chow Egg secret. I wonder why, if the egg wasn't a bomb, unless it was a bomb. And Maybe the chow is the bomb. It's a is, glitter bomb. Oh, because they weren't as tough as us. I don't know. Who cares? What a precious treasure. A beauty to behold. Maybe they naturally <laughs> died of old age and just kept the secret with them. They didn't want to tell the tale that they thought it was a bomb because that would be embarrassing. <laughs> uh, as much fun as this has been... We should get out of here before we're spotted. It's a good theory. Is there not from CCTV chat. in this room? It's a good theory from chat that um, the other two were bombs. <laughs> <and laughs> this was the only one that, that wasn't a yeah, bomb. They're, they're, yeah, exactly. <laughs> good call. Let's go. No one seems to suspect anything, and the security guard is back at their post. If Ned Flanders is back at his post, then wouldn't he notice people coming out of the lift that's right next to... Eh, questions for later. skills very high. Questions for later. I hope they subdued the drink coaster fiend okay. Thank you both for your assistance. That hunt was exactly the thrill I was seeking. Stealing was... Strangely fun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do it all the time now. <laughs> Starting with this coaster. <laughs> now, Rouge. The coaster, then Rouge. <laughs> <laughs> you can just tuck Rouge He's... under that little hat. <laughs> no one will suspect of Rouge. She's completely absorbed in that bedazzled chow. What? 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 What is it, darling? About those blueprints. Now that you're done with them, maybe we could take a look. While I appreciate your assistance, it's as I said, finders keepers. I'll need them a little longer in case I missed any other treasures. But I promise to let you take a peek later. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I'm sure you get it, sweetheart. You can't just add sweetheart to the end of a sentence to make things better, but sure it you does can. I'm going to do it all the time now, sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't think there's any reasoning with her. She's more powerful than me, and oh... Her drool is so no, bedazzling. Don't. Oh my god, don't. <laughs> well, we'll get out of your way then. Uh, bye bye, miss, mistress. <laughs> <laughs> Before you go, Shadow gave me and Rouge one of these he passed through earlier. Let me unlock the door so you can continue forward. You know, we've had a lot of people mention you, Rouge. But we also have just as much suspicion about Shadow for some reason. I think it's his name. And also how he's kind of a eugenicist. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, just like on and off evil. He's kind of, he's Vegeta. <laughs> he's, the, yeah, he's Vegeta. He's Vegeta to Sonic's Goku. That's, that's what he is. Just... That's Doors unlocked. Both of you stay safe. Will do. Come on, Bingus. <laughs> Let's you head out. Fucking Bingus. <laughs> bingus. Oh, Bingus. <laughs> bingus. 
the capabilities of these robot arms are quite spectacular. I'm impressed every time we see them. I can't help but wonder how they're controlled. I don't know. The conductor was ordering oh, it around a bit he? earlier. Yeah. At the very least, things operate much smoother with them here. I wouldn't worry about it. Yeah, that is true. They're very versatile. <laughs> oh. I think we should just, like, play the slot machines. Hmm. Should I give the slot machine a try? <laughs> All right, let's see. Big money, big money. Uh, well, I lost. <laughs> yes, yes, do it. All right, let's Feel see. The big money, flow. big money. Well, <laughs> I lost. <laughs> well, no, I, keep doing I it. Lost. You're bound to win eventually. Bingus. <laughs> What do you expect to happen if you keep playing? Big, big money. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get it this time. You, you'll see. <sighs> well, <laughs> I lost, but, but I'm gonna get it. <laughs> well, I lost. And this is how Bingus ruins All right. his life. Let's see. Come on, <laughs> come on, come on. Uh, <laughs> you know. The definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over, expecting a different outcome, right? I'm starting to get worried here. Don't, don't, don't worry, Tails. I don't have a problem. I can stop any time I like. We're not, we're not gambling, <laughs> chat, because we're not, we're not losing anything apart from <laughs> wasting your well, time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I lost. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> oh, I lost. <laughs> this is character. Have you ever heard of the sunk cost fallacy? The the sunk cost fallacy? The phenomenon. Oh, no, this is a Metal Gear Solid cutaway to a documentary. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the phenomenon <laughs> whereby a person is reluctant to abandon a strategy or course of action because they have invested heavily in it, even when it is clear that abandonment will be more beneficial. Of course I've heard it. Why why do you ask? No reason. Alright. <laughs> oh, I lost. Uh I'll be over here when you decide you're done. Alrighty. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's fine. I'm only twenty <laughs> grand in the hole. Uh, uh, You've if, not even if I tried just, the Texas Hold'em game yet. <laughs> if I if I just play play a bit more, I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win, Bingus. <laughs> come on, Bingus, you got this. <laughs> oh, money, Bingus. Big money, Bingus. <laughs> oh, thanks, goodness. I really thought I lost you there for a second, buddy. <laughs> yeah, let's let's go. I. I don't now owe my employer five <laughs> years of wages. Uh, uh, uh. Dr. Eggman's built a lot of casinos to run around in, but I've never actually sat down to play any for fun. Um, Let's fucking well, play well, some Well, well you Blackjack should, because it's, it's really, really that fun. That table's not set up for Blackjack. <laughs> I don't know much yeah, about that's Blackjack. Why we've got I know that's Hold not him. what you play there. I don't know how to play that. Yeah, Tails is eight. <laughs> <laughs> Bingus, we simply don't have time for... Bingus! <laughs> we simply don't have time for this. We must avenge so the first time someone's missing Sonic this in like is two hours of play. This is acknowledgement that Sonic is dead. You had time to plan and commit a heist. <laughs> <laughs> but not to play a hand of poker. Good to know. <laughs> he's admitted he's dead. And that's that's the first step. Probably that's a good point. That's the first step in the grieving process. Well, everyone knows <laughs> how to play blackjack. I don't know how to oh, play that. Come on. Bingus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's go. Um, ready to get going? Uh, uh. <laughs> Feel the addiction flow. <laughs> Let's do it. 
like they do in the Discovery Channel. <laughs> We're nothing but mammals. <laughs> the lounge car. Ooh, I'm kind of digging this. This is where I would hang out for sure. Smooth, smooth jazz. Like just a little cabaret car with a, a little. Who was um, Amy? I think I was Shadow, but it's been a long time since oh, Shadow. Okay, I'll be or... I'll be Amy then. Um, I know you won't talk, but I know exactly why you've been locking those doors. It uh, it's hard to get a word in as you talk over me. I have my reasons. I I am the ultimate life form. No reason is convincing enough, even if you're the ultimate life form. It's inconceivable what you did. You keep saying that word. <laughs> I don't think it means what you think it means. <laughs> hey, hey, what's going on? <laughs> I see you made it here, Tails. But I didn't expect the Iron Chef as well. Oh, that's that's a quite a good... That's Ooh. quite a good put down. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll see what you say when your microwave chili dog's <laughs> delicious, you bitch. Ah, they said chili dog. I'd also like to know why you've been locking doors throughout the train, Shadow. Well, it seems Amy already knows, so ask her. Hmm. I'm not saying a thing. You lot will have to tell me why. Now, if you could leave me be, I have an appointment coming up. An appointment? Who wants to meet with him? I'm getting a portrait done for best <laughs> ultimate life form of the month. <laughs> <laughs> There's a whole wall of them. <laughs> I've won it 12 years <laughs> running. <laughs> I'm 12. Oh no, they do it monthly. Every year they have to take them all down and then they refresh <laughs> them. I am, of course, the only person working at my place of work because, as I said, I'm the ultimate life form. I'm the only one good enough to work here. <laughs> well, Bingus, it seems like Shadow isn't going to talk. Let's do some investigating. All right. Ready to find some answers, Tails? Indubitably, my dear Bingus. <laughs> ah. Oh, those those are the robot arms. Okay. Is that chandelier just a solid diamond? <laughs> How does that work? Um, I believe that uh, chat were implying that the um. Anything can be a certain device if you're brave enough. Um, <laughs> whilst okay. looking at the yeah. chandelier, so um, sure, all right, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, who's gonna be coming out of the closet? Bingus, could you open the wardrobe, please? Sure. Wait, is there a reason you want me to do it? Oh, I put Sonic's body in there. <laughs> this whole thing has been a massive setup to frame you for the murder I did. <laughs> Congratulations! I just think you should do it. <laughs> <laughs> watch a pro. All right, Whoa, watch a watch a pro. Uh, uh, I've been a professional uh, wardrobe opener for. <laughs> <laughs> um, a professional wardrobe is that someone who like habitually outs closets his people because that's evil <laughs> bingus all oh, this dust you opened the door too fast it blew everywhere <laughs> oh this oh there is one thing in there okay hmm tails do you see this a pull string bingus <laughs> What? It's got to activate something. What? The the back of the wardrobe opened. And there's a door to... <laughs> and a lamppost and snow and fir trees. 
<laughs> the rest of the game is just the whole Chronicles of Narnia. <laughs> you do the whole thing, and then you have to get back to working out who killed Sonic. <laughs> There's there's a full passageway back here. And Ow. there's a weird fawn. <laughs> he says his name is Mr. Tumnus. He's inviting me for tea. There's going to be sardines and cake. And he's definitely not going to kidnap me and sell me to the secret police. <laughs> 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 oh my God, we're doing this. Okay. He's curious. This means something big. Oh, no. <gasps> There's a yeah. secret passage from the lounge to the... Lo Shadow may have killed Sonic if he's got access to secret passages from the room he locked himself into. This is the library. There's a secret passage from the lounge to the library? I don't believe and it. And I work here. <laughs> Back through the passage before they spot us. And we and have give to us poetry. <laughs> hear more of Gilbert Godfrey's poetry. <laughs> nah, it's as good as Vogue on poetry. <laughs> uh, we need to add secret passage to our inventory. <laughs> Lop. Just yoink. <laughs> Stick it in your pocket. Why is there a shitty computer in a printer there <laughs> in this cool jazz lounge hmm a key ring must be shadows the locksmith interesting there's only two keys i figured a locksmith would have a bunch want to take it yeah let's take it i love stealing things now <laughs> i've got a taste for this Hey, what's that we go back there and smash open one of the slot machines? <laughs> <laughs> Seems a printer is hooked up to the computer. Can, can we print something? Just like a picture of a Rouge's mouth. <laughs> just as she's salivating. No, just a bit. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Why is it going to be Sonic? Why is it always Sonic with you guys? Huh. This printer is surprisingly tricky to use big moves. And uh, yes, and water's wet tail. <laughs> <laughs> tricky? Yeah, the user interface isn't very clear, but I won't let it stump me. I'm going to have this. <laughs> and here you go. Sonic rowing a boat. Yep. yep. This is exactly what I asked for. Uh, gonna, gonna put this away. <laughs> Don't like to think how how Sonic is. Who took that picture? Horrifically dead. Uh, Who took that took that picture under what circumstances? Can we get the other one? Yeah, obviously. Hang on, I think I remember what buttons to press. Have you ever had a printer work when you want? Uh, oh, that's that's disappointing. Oh shit, that's. That's actually the dead-eyed gamer hat guy from Sonic Forces, right? Yeah. That's actually... That's Guga. Um, that's Shingles Guga... Shingus... Shingles... Bingus Guga... The Gen... The Genders. No. Guga Bingus Shingles? Some combination. Gen oh, Yeah, God. but it's definitely... That's definitely who it's intended to be, though. That is. That's not just us making a joke. That's 100% what's going on there. Yep. Oh, I, I got a M, M has said of Shingles, Bingus, Gugar, the all the genders, which Flowers does not agree that that's the arrangement of the names. <laughs> Who knows? It's lost yeah. to time. We could technically go back and rewatch it on YouTube. They told us about this in my interview. The lounge has a computer complete with internet access for casual browsing. How lovely. Seems convenient. Not as convenient as just having a smartphone, which we <laughs> all of us carry around everywhere we go, but, you know. It is a shame to be on the computer and missing these gorgeous views, though. None of these compartments have... This is the first compartment we've been in that has had a window. <laughs> <laughs> just, just for a little bit of context. I feel like if you're using the computer here, you must really need to use it. 
I mean, there aren't even toilets on this train. Tails. No. Tails, I think we should check the trash bin. Every trash bin has been empty, Bingus. And you've been disappointed every time. But, but, maybe, maybe just this <laughs> one. Maybe this one will be the one <laughs> that, that gets me the big wit. Uh, I mean, that has something in it. <laughs> Are you gonna get sad again if there's nothing in the trash bin, Bingus? Yes. There's always something! <sighs> <laughs> Alright, let's check the trash bin. <gasps> What's this? <laughs> Is it trash? Is it trash? <laughs> Is it. Is it more tokens for the slot machine? <laughs> <laughs> it's trash! Someone printed out the front page of a ticket website. It's for the band Hot Honey. You can see them in the background, those hot, hot honeys. Interesting. Hot Honey is one of Amy's favorite bands. Who cares what it is? Let's add it to our inventory. I'm really not sure how this qualifies as a clue. <laughs> like, oh, Amy's on the train. That explains everything. <laughs> <laughs> There's always success if you check the trash bin and play the slot machines enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we just didn't play them enough. That was our problem. <laughs> I think we found enough clues. We're going to crack this case wide open for some reason. How is that enough? To pin a murder on... We've not seen anything that actually applies to Shadow. Why did you come over here? There's nothing I can help either of you with. I ask that you leave me alone. That stare. So cold. It just reminds me of the cold drool dripping out of <laughs> Rouge's mouth. Sorry. 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 Oh Sorry. 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 No, you, could, you, <laughs> could, you can keep going. I will just react this way every time. You know, and maybe so we will, will get out of here, actually. Bingus, we certainly will not. You don't know how this works. <laughs> can I take... You've got to try to take their order every time. <laughs> I'll take you up on that coffee. When I'm back in the dining car, oh, I'll whip that right up. No, I mean, I I, I want to go out for coffee with you. <laughs> I, I think you're beautiful, Bingus. I may be the this perfect life form, but to there's me, no better combination than to you me, you're perf <laughs> and me. <laughs> the perfect combination. Some marshmallows would make it perfect. In coffee... Tails? What the fuck? <laughs> sure. Maybe in a mocker. It took every muscle in his body to agree with Tails. That's how much he loves you. Why is this the end of the... Why did you come over here? Shadow, we have questions for you. Will you three get out? I'm busy. As I said, I have an appointment to attend to. Sorry, but this is important. Shadow, we've questioned everyone on this train except the conductor, and every single person has mentioned running into you. You've been locking every door in this train, and... And I know why. <gasps> oh. Pray tell, why was I locking all the doors? <laughs> Time to reveal my hot tip. Oh, please don't. <laughs> <laughs> Hope everyone's ready for a scoop found by yours truly. We're ready. According to the map, the next car is the conductor's car where Sonic was stationed. This door right here in the lounge car is the only door that leads to the conductor's Doctor's car following. Okay. So Shadow was locking all the doors for one reason and one reason alone to keep Sonic from escaping the conductor's car. His body is on the other side of the train, <gasps> but like, sure. The conductor killed Sonic so he could get railed in peace. <laughs> 
Uh, honestly, <laughs> seems plausible. Sonic is very annoying. <laughs> Our other theory, Shadow Sonic Trist was going on. <laughs> so you think Shadow was trapping Sonic? I sure do. He locked the conductor's car, then locked all the others, so no one locked door wasn't suspicious. Shadow's what? face is just, I'm surrounded by idiots. <laughs> Pure conjecture. You all, get out and leave me be. Leave me to my ultimacy. Well, my source can back up these claims. They will remain anonymous, but I think the point stands. It's me. I know best because I'm Amy. Did and I it's mention my it's my birthday? Fucking birthday! <laughs> for fuck's sake! And you're ruining it all, Shadow! Just because you're the ultimate fucking being! Just one day I want to be about me and not fucking you! Oh my god, just go on like a full. <laughs> For like five minutes improvised rant. <laughs> <laughs> like your Leo DiCaprio. <laughs> My source claims they never saw Sonic again after he went to the conductor's car, apart from when he we saw his corpse at the <laughs> other end of the train because <sighs> Why? <laughs> because he was trapped and couldn't leave the conductor's car except to go and be dead at the <laughs> other end of the train. Reckless speculation. Is the logic sound, though? Was Shadow trapping Sonic? I'll play along and follow this train of logic, Amy. <laughs> Get it? Cause, Cause, we're on a train. Sometimes it's hard to we're believe. We're on a fucking what? Because there's a there's a fucking lift with a bank vault. <laughs> um, but we are still technically on a train. Um, if Shadow did lock the door to the conductor's car, imprisoning Sonic, <laughs> then how was Sonic found in the dining car? Then again, when the train sped up. We, like, went flying. Maybe Sonic flew the entire length of the train, and um, when he landed, that was what killed him. <laughs> Just blunt force trauma from the floor, <laughs> having flown 200 meters down the length of a train. <laughs> <sighs> I think that's what's happened. <laughs> Shadow agrees. Exactly. I think Bingus and I can explain the car change, however. Uh, Bingus, what evidence do we have that shows Sonic could have gotten into the dining car? Is it the cool picture of him with a rowboat? Uh, it's the, <laughs> the menu, menu. Right? Yeah, Of course it's the menu. No, no. This, this feels wrong. This feels wrong. And yet so right. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, just do it. Okay, just get my thoughts in order. Oh. <laughs> you crap. forgot you have to I do have, this. I have this bullshit. <laughs> this, you have to go to Binkus' mind palace. Uh, the, uh, <laughs> I totally remember what, what buttons I'm pressing and why we had a keyboard in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, no. You're really near the end as well. Oh, one more, one more, one more. Just barely. And you know we halved the number of rings you need <laughs> on the options. Bingus and I found a hidden passage in the wardrobe that leads right to the library car. That doesn't explain how he got two more cars over. What? A, a, a secret passage through, through the mountain? <laughs> and die. <laughs> <laughs> so someone could have used the passage, snuck through the library car, walked past the distracted boys playing arcade, and safely arrived at the dining car! But Shadow was playing the arcade game. That's why they were playing the arcade game, to beat Shadow's high score, you dingus. X. <laughs> hmm, this, this adjusts my theory a bit. 
So, Shadow murdered Sonic in the conductor car just to steal the day away from <laughs> me, Amy, who Here is the go. birthday princess, by the way, and just because he's the ultimate being doesn't mean that he should get every day for himself, but then thought that the crime scene was so close to his station, it was suspicious. And, and and then Shadow picked up Sonic. He he locked the door to the conductor's car, and th then he went through the secret passage. And then he climbed onto the outside of the train. And then he uh, I don't know anymore. I, the more you characterize Amy, the more I think Amy did this. <laughs> <gasps> Officially accusing Shadow of murder? I, I, I am, and and he murdered just to steal the spotlight away from me. He murdered he the vibe. He couldn't. But of course, with... this is just a theory. <laughs> Wink. He, he, <laughs> he couldn't cope with not being the center of attention for one fucking day. <laughs> But of, of course, course I would be just the center a theory. of attention. I'm the ultimate life form. I, Everybody look at me. I, I don't have any evidence to back this up other than my hot scoop. <laughs> ah, seems Tails and I were more thorough than you, you bitch. <laughs> if Shadow's not going to talk, then I'll humor you once again. This is not... This is not how any form of justice is supposed to work. <laughs> if Shadow traveled through the hidden passage and appeared in the library car, then how did Espy and Vector not they were fucking? <laughs> We've established this. Well, um, they, they were having sex. <laughs> I suppose it would be hard to sneak around two people uh, unless they were having sex. Bingus, do you have any guesses? Oh, well, <laughs> Espio and Vector didn't see Shadow because they were having sex. Vector was with Knuckles. Plot twist. That's true, Vector was with Knuckles and wouldn't have seen Shadow enter the library car. See? Things are falling into place. It was all shadow and all just to take the spotlight away from me. Do you, do you know what this is giving me, actually? This is giving me Madeline Kahn in the movie of Clue. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yes. Like, I just, I hated him so much. Just <laughs> flames. <laughs> but, but what about Espio? <laughs> I believe Espio was behind a bookshelf at a table reading. Huh? <sighs> Espio reading in the library checks out. That's what he told me too. He's lying. What, what was that, Shadow? When I completely obliterated Knuckles and Vector at that whatever game, just like I didn't do to Sonic, <laughs> I left the saloon car. I spent some time looking for Espio, but he was not there. He was not in the library car. Like, I believe you. You're currently my number one suspect. Why were you even searching for Espio, huh? It's very suspicious. I think he's a very talented poet. <laughs> I wanted him to... Allow me to listen to his latest work. I'm a huge fan of slam poetry. <laughs> it's truly the ultimate artistic expression. If you must know, I needed to give him a key. As if. Why would a locksmith be giving away his keys? That's what locksmiths do. They make <laughs> keys and they give them away to the people who need keys. Locksmiths are not key keepers. Shadow has been giving away a lot of keys actually. 
Everyone but us seems to have one. We have two. <laughs> that, that's true. Everyone's been able to lo unlock the next door for us. Did everyone just decide to kill Sonic together? Was it a mutual thing? And it's because murder they were on the all, Orient Express. And because they were going to it's like point at each Orient other, Express. like no one would ever know, so they would all get away with it. Chat, what do we reckon? Is it Murder on the Orient Express? I don't know what happens in Murder on the Orient Express. Oh, everyone did it. I have never seen it. a red. Everyone did it? Everyone did it. Wow. <laughs> uh, and, and, and now chat is saying, uh, polycule date idea, uh, murder. <laughs> <laughs> uh, be gay, do crimes, kill Sonic. That's, that's the title of our YouTube one. <laughs> I, I didn't know that. Shadow's been passing out keys, but I'm supposed to be the special birthday princess with the key, and now Shadow's taking that away from me. If you decide he's got to be playing a locksmith, perhaps Bingus and I can further validate Shadow's claims. We, we can do what? Tail, um, Bingus, what evidence supports Shadow's claim that he was giving keys away? The keys that he kept on him? That's not gonna work. Uh, it's, it's, it's the trash. It's the trash. <laughs> it's, it's, it's all it's, it's trash. It's trash. It's all trash, Sam. It's trash all the way down. Think. Bingus is dream gear. I love that even in his heart of hearts, Bingus just wants to be Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know how in the Matrix you have, like, your residual self-image, which is why you appear, like, as an awesome, cool person in the Matrix, even when you're emaciated and bald in the real world? Yeah. This is Bingus's self-image. He's Sonic in his head. <laughs> There's only one reason there's exactly two keys on that key ring. Those were the two keys Shadow meant to give to Espio and Vector. No way! That's so unfair! Well, what of his own key? Can one of those be for him? I have my own key army. Huh. Interesting. So, let's say Shadow's telling the truth then. Then what? Are you going to say that it was me I murdered Sonic just so I could have the title of a game to myself? <laughs> Amy the fucking Hedgehog! <laughs> Why won't you let me collect some rigs? Why won't you let me do the cool loop-de-loops? I mean, you can. You just have Bastards! to pay... $59.99 for Sonic Origins, the one edition they put in on these games that have been out for 30 years. Uh, uh, I, I, I'm worried that Amy might be getting a bit unhinged. <laughs> if, if Shadow didn't murder Sonic and bring him to the dining car, then only Amy could have. <laughs> I, I mean, uh, then, then what possible reason could he have had for locking all the doors? No, no, the cat's out of the bag now. You have done the evil voice. <laughs> <laughs> the person who did the evil voice when I accused them, they always did it. The evil voice does not lie. Although it is not admissible as evidence in a court of law. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, she's right. Her theory is strong. Tails and I certainly haven't presented any possibilities. Is Shadow really innocent in Sonic's murder? I've just realised that Tails should have been speaking with a Poirot voice this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's probably it's too, too late. late to do it. It's not it's... too late. It's never too late. Oh my god. I think... <laughs> I think Bingus and I know exactly why Shadow was locking all the doors. Why does he keep including me too? I'm just saying Tails is getting into the role now. First, Amy, I have just one question for you. Uh-huh. Has everyone today given you a birthday present? 
Oh, most everyone. Yeah, everyone's been so sweet. Except maybe Shadow, because he <laughs> keeps trying to steal my fucking thunder. Uh, this is of the most regrettable. <laughs> <laughs> Just um, uh, Shadow and Sonic haven't given me anything yet, but that's okay. Just them being here is enough. I I I like Shadow. Understood. Obviously. Understood. Thank you, Amy. <laughs> Bingers. <laughs> uh, I guess tails. Also, why has your voice changed <laughs> so drastically? I'm just going to say, when Tails is talking to Bingers, he uses his real voice. Because <laughs> he doesn't need to put on a show with Bingers. They're best mates. They're, they've said more to each other in this game than Tails and Sonic have ever said to each other in 30 years. I have a theory, but I need a piece of evidence to support it. We know Shadow walked through every train car locking the exits, and he gave everyone stationed in the cars a key. What if Shadow's a ghost? Except for you, me, and Amy, and I know I didn't kill Sonic. <laughs> That's right, the conductor gave Amy her birthday key, not Shadow. So why would he lock all the doors and not give us a key? Chat is saying that Amy and Shadow should fuck the way we're doing their voices. <laughs> <laughs> Was Shadow locking all the doors to keep us away because we're the murderers? <laughs> did did I black out and bludgeon Sonic the Hedgehog to death with a candlestick in the dining car? <laughs> <laughs> Not us, Bingus. I'm making a leap here, but stick with me. <clears throat> I think <laughs> Shadow was trying to keep Amy away. <laughs> uh. oh. <laughs> what? Excuse me? You're trying to keep me away on my special birthday? Day. I bet it's not even a Shut special birthday. She's probably like... Shadow. She's probably like 26. Shadow! <laughs> you surely you could never do that. It's my you could You could kill someone in cold blood, but day. you'd never spoil the birthday of someone you, you don't you, like. You know it's my <laughs> fucking birthday, right? Don't you, Shadow, you... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, how dare... Bingo, show me the evidence! That Shadow doesn't know it's Amy's birthday? I'm confused what evidence we're supposed to be... Uh... Uh -huh. If Shadow was trying to keep me away, prove it. You've been so fucking thorough, <laughs> or whatever, with your investigation. What proof do you have? Oh... Okay. Oh, oh, is it the okay. trash? Okay. Uh, 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 the menu. <laughs> the it's, menu. It's, it's the menu. <laughs> she just doesn't like the food. <laughs> Has she? Have we not seen what's on the paper? Think. Um. Yeah. It's it's a birthday present for Amy. Someone's oh. buying her concert tickets. Oh. So Shadow's innocent. I think. Who'd have so. thunk it? <laughs> He's so evil. Um, and he does keep stealing Amy's thunder on her birthday. I mean, I was thinking more like the eugenics, but... <laughs> <laughs> but sure, like, yeah, he's stealing Amy's thunder. <laughs> but it's her fucking birthday. <laughs> you went rooting through the trash? You really are scum. I what mean, is I mean, I still want to go on the date with you, but <laughs> is is that trash? I wouldn't touch that in a thousand years. Oh, we found this in the trash bin next to the printer. It's of a band's ticket website. Tails don't. Oh, oh, this is Hot Honey's website. No way, I. Love That's a lot of detail on that picture. 
uh, hot, hot honey. Um, is 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 that a band or something else you were looking up on the computer? It's the band I'm currently obsessed with. Jeremy B. Is, <laughs> Jeremy uh, B. Why, why not Charmy? Just put Charmy the B into this game for fuck's sake. My current favorite. All, all the members have B after their name. Yes. Isn't it cute? I haven't gone to any of their shows yet to see them, though. I really hope that none their of them are Their tickets are really hard to get. You have to be ready online at a specific time, and they sell <gasps> out in minutes. Chat suggesting Paul McCart be. <laughs> <laughs> so the question yes. becomes, why was this paper found in the train car Shadow was stationed in? Watch yourself, Fox. Fox hounds. <laughs> <laughs> the situation is becoming much clearer. I don't know how Tails figured things out so soon, but I Justin see Justin Bieber, Elvis Presby. <laughs> <laughs> Gerard B. <laughs> oh my uh, god. Chat, we love you. The printout of the Hot Honey Band Tickets website exists because Shadow's a <laughs> big hot <laughs> yes, honey yes. fan. <laughs> Leave now. <laughs> uh, I, don't, I don't know what Shadow listens to. Oh, it you don't want to know. You don't want to know. <laughs> He's buying a birthday gift for Amy. What? Shadow, is this true? How could I possibly have ever suspected you of murder <laughs> when you would do this? Um, I'm sorry, this is the perfect alibi. If you've just murdered someone and then you're just like, here's an inducement. <laughs> <laughs> That's all he ever says. I've done a poor job hiding the surprise, it seemed. I never thought someone would stoop so low as to go through the trash. It's kind of kinky, though. I'm not saying I don't like it. <laughs> I mean, yes, I'm trying to get you concert tickets for your birthday, but Bingus, if you would also like to go to a hot honey... Sh uh, Shadow? Oh! <laughs> I used that printer earlier and I found it difficult to manage. When logging onto the website, did you print the home page by accident? How the... Yes, that's exactly what happened. I'm not fantastic with computers, admittedly. I'm only the ultimate being. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't believe this after I accused you of murder. <laughs> Spill everything, Shadow. The cat's out of the bag. I want to know everything. How did you murder Sonic? <laughs> How did it feel to have his blood dripping down your face? Did you feel the warmth you know leave what? his heart as you held it in your hands? <laughs> oh. Whoever did kill him. How did they bleach all the blood off their spotless white gloves? <laughs> Fine. Um, the, the, the conductor's definitely just got red gloves. <laughs> <laughs> the surprise is ruined anyway. Oh, probably. Probably have fault there. I mean, we were saving Shadow's life. Ah, sorry, that is most regrettable <laughs> of the most regrettable, but... It is all the job of a detective, I suppose. Huh. When I arrived on the train, I realized everyone else had a gift. Huh. Except for me. Huh. Worried for my social status, I immediately began brainstorming ideas, and I saw the computer. Have you ever heard of the Internet Snake? <laughs> <laughs> it's Here's a, a 50 minute documentary. Network. <laughs> It's in the future it would be possible for anyone to order anything from anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
we'll truly be living in the future. I remembered Amy had never seen Hot Honey live and looked it up. The computer has a ton of viruses on it now. <laughs> That's when I accidentally printed the home page. I also accidentally visited hothothoneys.com <laughs> and also <laughs> hothoneysinmyneighborhood.com. <laughs> Concert tickets weren't actually on sale, I realized, but would be available soon, as soon as I could plan a heist. Is that the appointment you keep speaking of? The time you're able to actually buy the concert tickets? Precisely. I haven't purchased the tickets yet. I knew I had to keep Amy away while I waited to buy the tickets, so... I began locking all the doors like a normal sane person. <laughs> <laughs> but Especially for the safety when of everyone. I knew that that Amy had very publicly been given a key that unlocks every door in the train at the start of this game. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah, that makes no sense. Um <laughs> Chat has been going through different B names. Um, and I've has really finally arrived at Hive Hot Yalex Bilfs. Andra. Hot Bilfs. Bees I'd like to fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh. But for the safety of everyone, I handed out keys so they could get in and out, telling them not to let anyone through. It didn't work. Amy still managed to make it here somehow. It's because the conductor gave me this it's my special princess birthday key it opens every door ever made and it's only for me shadow you bastard got a fucking cake on it the pan's fatal flaw the birthday key the birthday that was introduced key. in a scene where all the characters were, were present, present. <laughs> the only time all the characters have been present I should have guessed. The birthday key for a random train is a well-known privilege <laughs> and tradition going back generations. Sonic generations. <laughs> <laughs> Shadow, I, your gesture is so sweet, and after I accused you too, just because you obviously did a murder... <laughs> Chat, I have seen Cove be young. I appreciate you. <laughs> <laughs> How about this? Let's buy the tickets later and make it up to you. You can come with me. <laughs> I'm I'm already coming with uh, with with Bingus. <laughs> I, I have eyes only for. I mean, I have eye only. I don't know how many eyes I've got, <laughs> but however many eyes I have, they're only for my trash princess bingers. <laughs> the all the genders. Too late. It's happening. E I can't wait for the show. <laughs> the show of a lifetime. A grand day out. <laughs> <sighs> Fine. <laughs> Happy birthday, Amy. If you like that kind of thing, which I don't. I expect lots of pictures from the concert, you two. Huh. I don't have a cell phone. That's why I had to use the computer. <laughs> <laughs> it's... <laughs> it's okay. Oh... Hold up my laptop's webcam. <laughs> <laughs> At the concert, it won't annoy anyone. <laughs> Seems the mystery of Shadow's locked doors has finally reached the end. Shadow's the kind of person who still holds up a real lighter at concerts <laughs> and gets thrown out, but it's okay because it's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> I blame my source for all this. That wasn't a hot tip at all. It was just his tip. I mean, um, <laughs> leading me to believe oh Shadow God. was behind everything. Why would the conductor tell me that unless he was trying to throw blame? Uh -huh. My credibility as a journalist reporter down the drain. <laughs> 
Amy, I am curious. Who is the source for your uh, big scoop? She made it the fuck up. I would like to know as well. Well, uh, I'm I'm sorry it's strictly confidential because her name starts with an A and ends in a Y and is three letters long. <laughs> My credibility may be shot, but my principles <laughs> must stay intact. Oh, you need intact principles. I have a strong feeling I know exactly who your source is. Uh-uh. But we need to investigate one last area. Poirot must go to the conductor's car. I'll come with you. I'd love to know who's been dragging my name through the mud. And I'll join as well. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> Time to see this through to the end. Yeah, don't disturb the conductor. Chat is right. It's like, he's getting <laughs> railed in there. He's We're getting more than happy to have you both. Bingus, I hate to say it, but I believe our investigation is finally coming to a close. The pieces are coming together. The full picture is becoming clearer is it? and clearer. Is it? Let's end this, Tales. We'll pin down Sonic's murderer for good. And right then on, then. Maybe I can get away with only ten years of therapy. <laughs> from and probably hard time. <laughs> This, this experience. <laughs> He's stolen a priceless artifact from his employer <laughs> on the first fucking day. <laughs> um, one second, I will be right back. Okay. I mean, other things he's done, he's attacked his only other fellow employee, the robot arms. Um, what else has he done? Gambled his savings away, developed an addiction to gambling try to rope tails a literal child into poker and fading that blackjack bingus is a yeah let somebody die oh burying the lead here thanks chat let someone die um he's been digging through bins to find dirt on people bingus this version of bingus is a bad guy he's not cool. I don't know who killed Sonic. I would argue that maybe the person who killed Sonic was doing the world a favor. I'm not sure Bingus... I'm not sure Bingus is the good guy here. <laughs> and he didn't give Shadow his coffee. Oh my god. He's not microwaved a damn thing since he got here. Um... Oh yeah, he really aggressively accused Amy of trapping them inside a compartment because she broke her hammer. That was a thing, stalking people. Like, Bingus is the bad guy here. <laughs> oh God. Um, we're just gonna take a little moment. That thing we said might happen early in the stream with the, uh, with the drink um, has actually happened. Um, so I'm going to extemporize, um, <sighs> what would you like me to talk about, chat? Give me a subject and I will say this while Sam gets a towel. Um, someone is accusing Bingus of microwaving coffee and that making him a bad person. I would say sometimes you forget you have the coffee and then you don't want to... Actually, I kind of like coffee when it's cold, but tea, you got to microwave cold tea. If it's got milk in it, disgusting cold. Um, yeah. You want me to talk about bees? Who do you think I am, Jessica Law? I can't do that. I can't beat Jessica Law at her game. Something other than bees. Kofi talking about uh, coffee. Small snails. Small snails, no. <laughs> Stop. No gastropods, frogs. no bees, no frogs. frogs. I'm going to talk about coffee. I'm going to talk about coffee. Um... um South American blends, really, really good. I recommend getting uh, beans whole and just getting a grinder and grinding them um, the day you want them or if you have to get out of the house early in the morning the night before. Um, they keep for longer than regular grounds. Um, they taste fresher. You can really taste the difference. Grinders are really cheap. Um, buying the beans whole is cheaper than buying the grounds. It's just sometimes a little bit harder to find them. Also, if you're like me, um, uh, sometimes um, 
I get a little bit like heart racy if Buzz, I have too much hesitation. coffee. But I, this is not the fucking <laughs> just a minute game. I'm da. Um, but like half half decaf, half regular. Put them together. You've got delicious coffee. You get like that little bit of a wake up, but you go go like boom 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 all morning. Um, it's it's really good. It's really good. And um, oh yeah yeah, um, summer's coming. Um, oh for me, light roast, light roast. Although I like a delicate flavour. Um, but I uh, sorry, that was a question from Cavill and Chat. I also recommend um, grinding your coffee. Put it in the cafetiere with some water overnight and just making cold brew. It is delicious. Have it with milk, have it without milk, whatever. It's it's really good. And it's really nice to wake up on a summer morning where it's already quite hot. Um, even up here in Scotland, it can already be quite hot inside on a summer morning. And just coffee, but cold. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Are we, no, uh, are we sorted? Coffee We're is, sticky but sorted. Is, is good. Yeah. No. Well done, by the way. That was that was super quick. Um, I. Okay, let's, let's crack this case. <laughs> let's crack this case. Ready to go to the conductor car? After a few more songs. It's now or never. No time for jazz. <laughs> Jacques. Ooh, that's definitely an evil conductor car. The conductor. Oh, look at the picture of his kid. Should really sort out my evidence before I continue. In my short time working on this train, I haven't visited the conductor's Wait, car yet. I had to ask. It feels empty. If that's his kid, Wait. is his kid also a conductor? Where, where's the conductor? Or is that him when he was young? I know that that's a picture of a kid. You don't have a picture of yourself where you're young in your office. You have a picture of the people you love. <laughs> uh, that's no, his kid. Because, uh, because if it was my office, I would have uh, a picture of me, but digitally aged. So <laughs> it's just me, but old. You just look like a sort of friendly wizard. <laughs> um. Wait, where's the conductor? Is is he under there getting he was sonic or railed? Uh, that is odd. I haven't seen him throughout the train at all. Last time we saw him is when he left the dining car. Something clearly happened here. I forgot Shadow was here. <laughs> Nothing we can't figure out. Come on, time to investigate. Okay, we gotta find. Let's crack on. <laughs> um, oh, was he poisoned? Oh, did this fall over when the train sped up? Not sure. Wait, what's it say on the mug? World's best train conductor. <laughs> <laughs> you got to print that conductor the whole way around the mug from handle to handle. <laughs> a cup of joe in your hand, wife by your side, paradise. All right, all right, we get it. He loves his wife. Pathetic. His wife is the train. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, what's this? Oh, he's been killed with poison darts. darts. <laughs> oh, my God. That's not a throwing dart. That's a blow dart. Snake, a blow dart is <laughs> a sort of weapon used from a blow gun. <laughs> or Somebody blow pipe. brought a weapon onto this train. <gasps> hmm, that, uh, that shouldn't be possible. Tails is right. The train detects any weapons on a passenger before letting them aboard, but not on a staff member like me. That's why I have all these guns. Indeed, it is of the most strange. <laughs> Let's make a note of this. <laughs> you know, I'm all right. I'm I'm fulfilled. <laughs> I don't need to check the bin. Oh, you do. You do. And, it's and and I don't need to go back to the slot machines. I I don't. I don't. I'm fine. Oh my god. 
something going through chat what if the robot hands were the things used to kill Sonic because then no blood would get on any gloves oh you are they do have gloves with though. finding a clue here before yeah but there are so many hands you know I know they always say always check the trash bin but I'm good I'll go out on a high note um, unless Tails can you look in there and see if there's any tokens for the slot machines in there uh. oh my that's the conductor that's well, gotta be a son that's gotta be a son so young in his uniform he's been here a long time after 32 years he's told me he's finally retiring he said he's headed to Spagonia with his wife I hope they have a great trip 32 years is a long time. I wish them a lot of happiness. Especially if they killed Sonic. May any future sorrow be fleeting. Because I'm going to kill him so quickly. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, I wish that too. You're not the only good person here, Shadow. Fuck. <sighs> This robot arm has been completely torn off. Yuck, how creepy. That arm is powerful. It'd be tough to break out of his grip. Obviously not for me, because I, I, I am the ultimate life form. A lot of people here have such strength to tear this off. But the question is why? A confrontation definitely occurred in this room. We should log this. Aye, aye, sir. <laughs> I think we've found enough clues. Let's talk to Amy and solve this once and for all. Well, you two, think you have enough evidence for me to call everyone here? It's high time we named us. Why suspect. here exactly? This is a very bad location to call everyone to. What do you think? Bingers. <laughs> Bingers. <laughs> ready to solve this case? Uh, I, I'm ready. Sure. I'm ready. Sure. <laughs> Hello, everyone. This is the birthday girl speaking. You know the radio. Please the radio's not to on. The conductor car <laughs> at once. The, we haven't. Your birthday queen demands it. The the tannoy's not on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> good God. <laughs> Wonderful to have you all here. Tails and I are ready to announce our prime suspect. Why are you so happy? Your friend is dead. From Why are you all so happy? Bingus. Why hasn't because he's Sonic dead? <laughs> because he's Why? dead. Why? Why hasn't Sonic? Wait, have shown these characters Why been going through Sonic this story, assuming that Sonic was going to be fine at the end of it? He's dead. <laughs> dead we saw him die there were blood he's and wounds dead. he's dead <laughs> did, Dave. did he think that it might have been pretend vector real quick can you come <laughs> with me to get sonic oh i i, I ate him <laughs> he must still be pretending to be dead lazy bum yeah, <laughs> gotta die fast. <laughs> <laughs> gotta decompose fast. <laughs> Let me tell you, darlings, this has been a delight. I always hate it. A delight. <laughs> the air in here is so intense, I love it. <laughs> Nothing like the smell of a room in which a conductor was recently being railed. <laughs> 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 the train has so many amenities. I feel so catered to just railings wherever you'd like. <laughs> Admittedly, I've been having a lot of fun myself. You may have noticed I'm trying on a new voice. <laughs> I see why you are a detective outside of this mystery, SBO. 
You and I love a good <laughs> thrill, it seems. But on this train, I am a humble poet. We can drop the pretense now. Like, the party is super cancelled, right? <laughs> <laughs> a person died. Why are we still doing this? I'd be willing to do an event like this again. It says here the train does escape <laughs> rooms as well. Escape the train? <laughs> Hammer. That's how you escape a train. It's literally printed on every window. I love this. Uh, Poirot loves escape rooms. Count Poirot in. I'm so glad everyone's having a good time and no one's been murdered <laughs> for real. I'm glad I can block out memories of mine at will. Maybe we could ride on a train just to relax sometime. Uh, uh, yeah, that would be fun too. Ah! Oh, Sonic's ah! actually dead. She's finally worked it out. She's finally worked it out. She's finally worked it out. It's okay. It's gonna be all right. It's gonna be all right. I love you leaned way back from the mic to do that and it still went woof on our meter <laughs> <laughs> on the monitors. Oh my god. <laughs> <sighs> what in the world? That that's Amy's voice. Quick, where's Amy? <laughs> oh. mm. Yeah, Sonic's dead. <sighs> mm? He, he, he's not responding to us. He's so rude on my birthday. <laughs> Why? Fingers wasn't very communicative Sonic. that, like, Sonic was actually there. What? Is he hurt? Why isn't he moving? Sonic? Sonic, can you hear us, darling? He's banged up. If there is a pulse, it's weak. Weak like his... Non-perfect life form body. Set him down, Vector. Make sure his head is propped up. That's for nosebleeds. I'll help you. Uh, I knew one of you would take <laughs> this too, too far, far and actually murder and someone. Outside my birthday. Which of these characters didn't realize they had to murder someone for pretend <laughs> instead of for real? <laughs> Which one of you did this to Sonic on my birthday, no less? What would be hilarious is if the hammer was caked in bloodstains. <laughs> Could this really have been one of us? There's no one else here, Knuckles, you fucking idiot. <laughs> so I'll ask you again, which one of you fucking did this? <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Well, this is all the most inexcusable. <laughs> um, Sonic's hurt. <laughs> I'm going to expose the monster who did this. Tails is not having it. I thought Sonic could handle anything. Even but death? As it turns out, <laughs> being stabbed 15 times isn't something he can handle. Somehow he met his match. I'm going to help you get to the bottom of this, Tails. Absolutely. Ignore this blood that's all over me. Me too. Same. We're going to figure out exactly what happened in this room and punish the one responsible. Maybe a lifetime's worth of railing will get you to understand. S Sonic, he was really hurt this whole time and I... I, I I did Yeah, nothing. you are super I... fired, Bingus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm writing my wrong. No, no, I you're not. Take down the murder. No, you're not. That's not how these things work. <laughs> Tails, Bingus, I have a big question to ask. Who did you kill Sonic? Did, did you this? kill Sonic? Who killed Sonic the Hedgehog? Who <laughs> killed Sonic the <laughs> Fucking Who was it who killed him? Who watched the life 
drain from his <laughs> eyes. Who did that? <laughs> to be Who fair, to be fair, have done that. To be fair, Sonic was alive when we found him, and he died as we were like, "That's weird." Sonic's on the floor because he was he was still conscious enough to go like, "So weak." That's true. Who could only Bingo saw Sonic have, die? Have done this? Who? Who could pop? No, seriously, who do we reckon it is? <laughs> um, I think it's fucking Amy. Like, no, no, it's, no one's examined Tails at all. And he's always been living in Sonic's shadow. In a very literal sense. Not because he is sleeping with Shadow, but because he is always second fiddle to Sonic. <laughs> no one no one has talked about I mean like because we passed out and we woke up in a room and Tails was awake right um, with Amy like nobody has actually gone what were you doing Tails at any point but so I still chat think it's is Amy split between Tails and Amy um, and a lot of the Amy is just for shits and giggles. Yogsathoth is not an option. <laughs> Stop saying Yogsathoth. Yogsathoth didn't do it. <laughs> uh, he's the key in the gate. Yeah, there have been a lot of keys in fairness. Um... It would be funny to see Amy's reaction to being accused. <laughs> Unless they did it together. That can't be right. Neither Tails or I can be the murderer. I said no, so. No, no, no. They teamed up on this shit. If Who they teamed, if the they teamed up on this shit, it would work. This. Who killed Sonic the Hedgehog? Tails is like, um... This again. I don't know. I think everyone else is on the level. Everyone else seems on the level. Um, I I don't think we've got... the Esquidna. I just wanted to say Esquidna. It's fine. <laughs> I don't think she's got much of an alibi. But she's not got much of a personality either. So That's <laughs> so, true. Like, if you'd expect it to be a character who... So we're going Blaze, right? Uh, That's Rouge. Rouge. <laughs> They're um, all the same. <laughs> That's racist. Hmm. I don't see it. Care to explain your reasoning? Oh, uh, well, um... Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Are we just going to go through Guilty all of them? Freed. SBO, you was the one to murder Sonic, weren't you? I did no such thing, my young friend. But if it's a battle of wits, you wish I would love to discuss things. Chat has noticed the music has changed Phoenix Wright style, so we're on to something. Oh, yeah. Let's discuss... What the? You're accusing Espio? I accuse nothing. I merely say it as it happens. <laughs> we already talked about this. The man was reading. You have nothing. Restating Espio's alibi would be helpful for everyone, I think. Then we can cross-examine it. Espio was locked in the library car reading. He only had access to the saloon car during the murder. However... New evidence has come to light that needs to be addressed. New evidence? Oh, that's right. Bingus, could you fill everyone in? What did we find that brings into question Espio's alibi? Um, <laughs> he's been acting very protective. Vector's suspiciousness. He's been oddly protective, and I believe he knows something. <laughs> Wait, it's out the room you don't have any friends. 
You go to the mat for your friends. I know SBO wouldn't do this to Sonic. I think you were off a little bit there, Bingus. What did we find out of the cities already? Espio could have left the library at any time because Tails and I found a hidden passage from the library car to the lounge car. In the lounge, the hidden passage exits behind the wardrobe and straight through Narnia. I feel <laughs> lucky we even found it. Once a king or queen or I hope non-binary kind of monarch in Narnia, always a king or queen or non-binary kind of monarch in Narnia. That is a perfect form of government, no problems with it whatsoever. Monarchy. But that is besides the point. <laughs> 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 Not only would SBO, why have I gone, why have I gone more Antonio Banderas with this? <laughs> why have I become Puss in Boots? <laughs> Not only would SBO avoid any locked doors, but that would put him in the car just before this one. You have no evidence I used any secret passage. I answered all your questions without flaw. I was reading the entire time, remember? Reading detective novels? It's true you didn't miss a question, but I think Bingus and I can explain that too. Uh, Bingus? Bingus! <laughs> How did Espion know everything in the train manual he was reading? Espio is a poet. I feel such a profession would make you quite the reader. I don't think... What are you getting at? There's a very good chance that, like... So, like, Homer, the poet, not a person, like, an oral tradition. I think there's a pretty good chance that most of these people who kind of collectively... Um, told the story these iterative poets who told the story of the iliad from memory couldn't read right and that's why the iliad is so fucking repetitive <laughs> <laughs> um you picked a random book from the shelf and memorized it just to guarantee yourself a clean alibi that is what? ridiculous yeah that is absurd <laughs> <laughs> I know this is a talented bunch, but Rouge isn't... Oh, there, there she is. But that seems like a lot. I, I don't know. It is plausible. SPO is particularly skilled. He, he does all that sponsorship for Audible. <laughs> <laughs> Call back to a while ago. <laughs> I've known SPO a long time. He once spared read a book I was reading just to spoil the ending for me. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm right, and Espio quickly memorized the book before entering the hidden passage, then Espio could have met Sonic in the conductor's car where he was murdered. Since we're only talking in what ifs, let me throw something at ya. How was I to know about the hidden passage? It's hidden. <laughs> That. That's <laughs> right. How would Espio have even known it was there? You said it yourself, kid. You were lucky to even find the passage. Bingus and I might not have the evidence to answer your question. We probably should never have accused you in the first place. I apologize <laughs> unreservedly. I will take my leave of you now. Oh, God. That was a... That was a... Oh... Thank God. I thought that was like we were going back to the start. Um, no. Guys, we are over nine o'clock, but I do not think that this game is going to go on long enough to get another episode. Are we cool to just hang around and see the ending? I I, I think... Like, it's, it, I can't be that I'm, long. I'm pretty good to go. Awesome. We're going to go there. Rouge, we need to see those blueprints. Blueprints? You stole blueprints? You stole fizzy lifting prints. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I already used it to scout for more treasures. Came up cold. You can have it. This right here is a blueprint to the entire train. This entire crazy, crazy train. 
SPO could have easily used this to find the hidden passage. What makes you think I ever saw those blueprints? Rouge had them. Well, Bingus, I do not know why I leave everything up to you. I Poirot never did this to Hastings. It would have <laughs> ruined their friendship within hours because Hastings cannot do anything. How... Uh, ooh. There's a code included with these blueprints I thought was odd. That code is classified information, just like blueprints are. Could these blueprints <laughs> have belonged to the conductor? That makes a lot of sense, actually. I remember the conductor pulling blueprints out to show me something during my interview. SBO could have swapped the blueprints, found out about the passage, and then stuffed them somewhere. Come to think of it, I did discover the blueprints in the library car. <laughs> no way! Oh so my god. radical! In my theory, SBO looked at the blueprints and then used the hidden passage to get to Sonic. His one mistake was memorizing them instead of taking them with him. <laughs> <laughs> Hoisted by your own petard, sir. Petard. <laughs> Within Amy's guidelines, the murderer can kill a single participant however they choose. The logistics are still vague, but Bingus and I have evidence on how Sonic was murdered. I'm unsure how much harm SBO caused. He's dead. <laughs> also, We've he established has a horn because he's, he's dead. a rhino. He's dead. He can he's not a rhino. Just stab him with he's his horn. He's not a rhino. He can how charge many times? him with his. Rhino He's a horn. chameleon. That's why he, the murderer, has been hiding in plain sight this whole time. Hey, 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 waka waka. But Bingus and I have evidence on how it was done. It's amazing how well rhinos blend in. <laughs> <laughs> 21st century clown uh -huh. says a rhino chameleon is a real thing. Oh, this is rich. Pray. Hell, if I that murdered was... Sonic, how did I do it? Man, you, man, you. <laughs> oh, did you not You're choose the menu? What would Sonic do? He'd go fast. <laughs> oh. Um. Sam is now using the computer attached to his laptop, which is very much on the opposite side of the desk where I'm what? sitting. And I should help, but I don't want to. Not enough rings. Not enough rings. I guess Sonic's death will go Back unsolved to forever. Back to the Mind Palace. <laughs> forever. <laughs> Can you imagine Benedict Cumberbatch as a cliffhanger, one of those bullshit cliffhangers in Sherlock just going, uh, sorry, not enough rings. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want to jump for those rings in boxes, those... Oh, well, yeah. this, is, this is probably the last one. This blood dart was found here in the conductor room. Shouldn't it be in Sonic? <laughs> I believe Espio used this to knock Sonic unconscious. Ah, uh, so you oh, mean... Oh, fuck. If he's alive, I'm going to be Sonic really pissed. Sonic might just be knocked out and all of this blood is just <laughs> uh, ke ketchup. Um, the conductor is still nowhere to be found, chat. That is correct. I'm unsure. He's more banged up than what a blow dart would do. Yes, then SBO took out years of pent-up aggression and frustration <laughs> on never being featured in his own game on Sonic. Yeah. According to Amy's rules, a blow dart counts as a kill for the murder mystery. It also killed him, <laughs> which is actually more substantively important. <laughs> My theory, therefore, is plausible. 
plausible, you say. Then why are there so many holes in it? I actually said it was plausible. <laughs> <laughs> you deny the allegations? Of course I do. Let me present the first fatal flaw. If I knocked out Sonic in the conductor's car, then how was Sonic found in the dining car? Oh shoot, that's a good point. But Tails was on something, I'm sure of He it. staggered in there bleeding and dying. I locked all the doors, and Espio didn't have a key. He would have had to take the hidden passage back. If he took the hidden passage back, he'd end up back in the library. Where he was supposed to be. Bingus and I know another way it could have been done. We, we do? What piece of evidence do we need to take a closer look at? Um, it's, it's, it's the hand. Right? Uh, it's, it's, it's the not one the thing hand. we haven't used. The menu? <laughs> <laughs> if we didn't pick up the evidence. Think, Bingus, think. It wasn't the wasn't the right the last one. I'm so sorry, Sam. I don't know why this is in the game. Like this because it's a Sonic. This game. looks like positive anti fun, even for Sonic. It should just let you retry straight away. It shouldn't just drop down and give you dialogue. You know? Right? That's some bullshit. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, this oh. is this is a bad one. If Sonic is the cause of us never solving Sonic's murder. <laughs> there we go, just don't Yeah! Got it. I'm so sorry I said that was a bad run. It was great. Um, yeah, but but flowers. I would like to point out that shut up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's take a look. If Espio didn't take the secret passage to get into the dining car, then what route did he take to get Sonic there? Did he use one of the bullshit things that are also on this tray, like an elevator and an <laughs> underground shopping there, mall. There's a pond. And a swimming pool on the roof. <laughs> Above the conductor car, and it goes all the way to the dining car. Huh. I didn't even see that area. Is that sort of, some sort of long attic? Um, no, they're Jeffrey's tubes. <laughs> According to these blueprints, why is Tails talking like this? I do not know. I'm so confused. According to these blueprints, there's a hidden path in the ceiling that <laughs> leads straight to the dining car. One that Solid Snake would be excellent at sneaking through. <laughs> Tails became French when we realized that he's Poirot and this is um, Orient Express. <laughs> Belgium, though. <laughs> Perhaps you can access it through the vent over there. <laughs> but Tails is only Belgian when speaking as the detective. That's like, he's doing this for show. The vent! Of course that must be the entrance to the path. I knew it all along because I'm the biggest specialist princesses, <laughs> birthday princess of them all. Allow me to check it out. My word. There is a path back there and a track. I should be more surprised about this, but I just cannot muster the energy. It's been a long day of super monkey ball. A, a track, huh? A track for the robot arms, I think. This must be the path the arms take to move throughout the train. So you're saying I somehow fit with Sonic in that vent and took him to the dining car? Tails, you're a smart kid, so I know you realize we both couldn't fit up there. Your heads are very big. <laughs> <laughs> Espio's right. This is feeling mighty flimsy, Tails. 
I need an answer. My name's getting dragged around here. How on earth would I get Sonic through that vent? Oh my god, no, don't, don't. Just give us one for the whole conversation, you know? Oh, 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 That's okay, definitely. you got this, you got this, you got this. Don't get hit by any axes or walk onto spikes. That's the trick. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah! Oh. Yes! When you play these, I feel like... You know when Richard O'Brien is an asshole outside um, <laughs> every Crystal Maze game? And he's just like, you probably got this. Oh no, you're definitely going to die. I was wrong. <laughs> I don't care. Everybody saw the broken robot arm on the ground, right? Clearly a fight broke out here. And one of these robot arms was a casualty. But what if one of the robot arms actually caught Sonic? Knuckles says there's a track the robot arms use that continues through the vent. You know a who robot likes robot arm robot could have arms. grabbed Sonic, passed out from a blow dart, and carried him to the dining car. You see, the laws of robotics only count when someone is awake. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, Sonic is not a human, so the laws of robotics are moot. <laughs> if you mean the laws of robotics are that a robot cannot harm or cause harm to a human through inaction <laughs> no one's a human here could could that be true dig a look at sonic he's clearly bagged up could the fight have been between sonic and the robot arms he fights robot arms all the time it Ooh. really should not be a problem i can see that those arms do look powerful is she horny for the robot arms sonic doesn't fall easily but if he's woozy from a blow dart the arms could have gotten him. Interesting theory tales, but you have to admit these are a lot of coincidences. I might not be able to link everything directly to SBO yet, but I have found one inconsistency. Mm -hmm. What kind of inconsistency? Someone here received false information, and I believe that information came from SBO. Who receives that information? This is way more involved than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Not quite. A hot scoop. Amy received a hot scoop that turned out to be false. <gasps> <laughs> oh no, it was a hot tip. It was a hot tip. <laughs> a hot, a, a hot, hot tip. tip. A um, hot tip. Oh. <laughs> Amy, you received a hot scoop, did you not? I think it's time you told us where that scoop came from. <clears throat> Tails, you're, you're right. Espio lied to me. Espio told me Shadow was locking doors to trap Sonic, but we found out Shadow was trying to keep me from discovering my birthday surprise. That scoop came from you, Espio? <clears throat> No, of course not! Amy must have misheard me! Misheard you? Y yes I said, uh, Sonic's going to get trapped with all these locked doors. <laughs> I was just looking out for my fellow passenger safety. I didn't blame Shadow. Do you know who should have been looking out for passenger safety? Um, Fucking Bingus. <laughs> Fucking bingers. <laughs> what a bingers that guy is. I don't know, Espio. <laughs> what? The evidence might not be airtight, but there's a lot being thrown at you that makes sense. I have to agree. You want us to believe you were lazily reading the whole time. While you were stationed in a room with a hidden passage? <laughs> 
And now oh you're God. lying to me on seriously, my birthday seriously. of all days. I oh. am only taking this to mean that my characterization is perfect and correct and perfect. <laughs> Just like me, Amy, the birthday princess. Oh my god, if the Sonic the Hedgehog, Tails the Fox, SBO the Comedian, Amy the Birthday Princess. <laughs> <laughs> I believe the murderer used the train's controls to move Sonic from the conductor car to the dining car and lied to Amy casting further blame on Shadow for no other reason than to cause doubt and confusion. When examining everyone's alibis, one clearly stands out as the weakest. Yeah, it's fucking tails is. I believe it's clear to everyone that it could only have been one person. Wow, that that's some Phoenix Wright pointing. That's a unflattering picture of Bingus, and we've seen nothing but unflattering pictures <laughs> of Bingus in our time uh, between this and Forces. It was you. SBR. Jacques. <laughs> you were the one who murdered Sonic the oh, Hedgehog. His horn's got blood on it. <laughs> hey, guys. Sonic, you're okay. And on my birthday, I am it's disgusted a that Sonic miracle. is not dead. I am absolutely incensed. Sonic, and just as we solve the mystery, SBO was a murderer. Right. SBO jumped me in the conductor car. Dang it, you got me. A blowed up the really it <laughs> It's non lethal poison. You'll just be sleepy for Wait, a while. Wait, he still actually poisoned Sonic. <laughs> Great, I could use a nap. Gotta snooze fast. Wake me up when it's not Amy's birthday anymore. I can't stand her when she's like this. <laughs> no wait, there's something important SBO left me there. Something important? I need everyone to listen. The train's a bad neck. <gasps> what does that mean? Um, a bad neck is a robot made by Dr. Robotnik to trap animals and enslave them into becoming robot soldiers. <laughs> Sonic law. Sonic, are you feeling all right? Do you need to lie back down? No, we need to get off this train. We gotta go. Fast. <laughs> <laughs> We're not safe. What? I mean, I do not know why I'm still doing this voice. The mystery is solved, but never mind. When I arrived at the conductor car, the conductor was already here. He was so excited to tell me all about the features of the train. He was really kind of boring. He kept going, fa ha 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 at the end of every sentence. But while he was telling me, I had a bad feeling. I asked to see the power source. The conductor hadn't even seen it. When we took a look, we realized the train's powered by a flicky. Not, not a flicky? Oh, fucking hell. That's a small bird. Yeah, that's a flicky. That's you a small bird. You don't know your Sonic at all, do you? Not in the slightest. There's only one person. I picked up nothing from to... the two Sonic games. Oh, we Flickies have weren't in the uh, <laughs> either of the other Sonics we played. You, you need to go back like thirty years. Yes. <laughs> There's only one person twisted enough to use a Flicky as a power source. Doctor Eggman, uh, Le Homme des Earths. <laughs> 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 I told the conductor the train needed to be destroyed. He refused. He said he was too busy railing it. Oh, no, it was railing him. The way <laughs> the conductor was describing it, it's more than a simple badnik. It's his wife. <laughs> <laughs> they have a son. Look at the pic. It's the conductor's friend. The train is his co-conductor. I don't know what it can You're do. not serious. And on my birthday. I'm never knowingly serious on your birthday, Amy. <laughs> They uh, certainly didn't tell me that in the interview. 
right as we saw the flicky, I felt a sting in my shoulder. It was the blow dart from Espio. That means the conductor was there <laughs> during the murder. <laughs> ah. Ah. Espio left. The lights in the room started to glow red. Hey, stop! What are you doing? I knew something was wrong and stood up. The arms came for me next. I spin dashed, that's not a word, right through the robot arm, <laughs> sliced it off the rail it was on. Wow, I was am I'm amazed he was able to do any of this poisoned. But another robot arm managed to grab me and pin me to the floor. Oh! The conductor screamed as the arms approached him, but... I was hit quite a bit before it all got to me. I was tripping balls. <laughs> oh no, and on my birthday! <laughs> Everyone, I have something to admit. I was the train conductor <laughs> all along! <laughs> I murdered Sonic the Hedgehog! Yeah, we already knew that. The situation has got so serious, why would you not just Come tell on. us? I thought that's how these murder games worked. You shoot <laughs> someone with a blow dart, they die, no, no, you SBO, eat their That's corpse. how murder works, not how murder games work. Are you crazy? It's just a make-believe game. No one should get hit with a blow dart. <laughs> uh, Dorian on chat, so proud of SBO for coming out as a twonky rhino. <laughs> 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 I was just following the rules. Use this blow dart on Sonic, stationed in the conductor car. It is laced with a non-lethal sleeping agent. Thank you again for choosing the Mirage Express signed staff. Brackets, bingus, close brackets. What is that? For fuck's says, sake. Use this blow dart on Sonic. Thank you for choosing the Mirage Express staff. What is this? Instructions? I was given the blow dart along with that card. It's signed staff. Who gave this to you out of the two staff of this train? <laughs> Come to think of it, one of the robotic <laughs> arms handed it to me. Ah! Uh. Weapons shouldn't be allowed on the train. Well, not on my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> what is the larger picture here? Who instructed those arms to, ta to attack? Who or what? Bingus! Who do you think attacked Sonic? What do I mean? What fucking voice? Who do you think uh. attacked Sonic and Andy Espio's <laughs> blood art? The well, I don't know the conductor's role in this. According to Sonic, I doubt he attacked himself on purpose. And while it could have been an accident, I think someone's been orchestrating things from behind the scenes. Someone wanted Sonic out of the picture and for a good while. The train itself is plotting something. Uh. First we learned the train's a bad nick and now it's out to get us. Once again, you keep saying the most ridiculous nonsense. You're seriously convinced the train has out to get us. I don't know what the train's full intent is, but clearly it's been tampering in our murder mystery game and that is the real crime here. Train, don't you know it's my birthday for fuck's sake? <laughs> Come out and show yourself. It's a train. Hey, me. It's my birthday and I don't need you fucking messing with it. I really want to know what your neighbors must think is going on <laughs> in this room. <laughs> they definitely know it's your birthday. <laughs> <laughs> but you've been having this argument for two hours. <laughs> Amy's hitting the wall with her hammer. I'm with you, Amy. The train can have it. This train can good and goddamn get it. <laughs> Come on, there's got to be another. I'm, I'm, go I'm going to go back to a normal Tales voice. What was that? Oh, it's, it's evil red. It's got eyes and a nose and a moustache. Is that the conductor? 
<laughs> Here, I can get him down. Don't touch him. Uh, uh, is the train talking? How horrifying and on my birthday. <laughs> of course I can talk. You fools were too distracted playing your little game to figure it out. We were right, weren't we? What are you plotting? I'm taking all of you to Eggman's base, where you will rot. Eggman? After I deliver your annoying party right to his egg fortress. Annoying? Who among us could possibly be considered annoying? <laughs> the conductor and I will be free to laugh and play games. Ride the open rails like we always planned. What are you... <laughs> Enough! The train's picking up speed. Everyone grab something. Oh, it's gonna happen again. Ugh. Which one of these buttons turns the train off? Whoa! Sonic! Ha 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 ha! Stay put until we arrive. Goodbye. <laughs> Whoa. No, they all die here. That's the end. I can't keep... <laughs> I can't keep my footing. Uh, oh! oh, we are back where we fucking started. We fall the entire length of the train. We actually did. Nice. Shit, we fell the entire length of the train. Hmm, a bunch of evidence have fallen out of my pockets. <sighs> My head, tails, Amy. Ah, is I am anyone here? Hello? terrified that this might be the start of part two of the game. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I think this might be a huge swerve. Oh my god. <sighs> no need to yell, bud. S Sonic, I'm so sorry. Uh, are you okay? I had this wonderful dream and you were in it. <laughs> and you were <laughs> hanging in there. It seems a train little bit. But a, where's everyone else? A great question, but for now, are you alright? Sonic the Hedgehog asking about me. I'm doing amazing! Yeah, wow! Amazing, huh? <laughs> you might have to share a bit of that enthusiasm with me. Um I have overcome and take it there. Let's get our bearings and take a look around. Good idea. Lead the way. Are we <sighs> playing through this entire train but with Sonic now? I think we might be. I I think we might need to call it there for a night. I I Yeah, it is it is half nine um on the dot. I think <sighs> we are perhaps stretching. I will do a little bit of research to work out whether this is in fact the end. Um and we will think about how um we continue this in what form um, but i think we need to call it a night um because it's I'm, getting i'm late. sorry cat i know you just just managed to pitch up and um <laughs> and now we are just finishing um this has been a real blast <laughs> so it even has, if it goes it to has. next week we can we can yeah like we've we got we got things even if we don't um oh you know, yeah. if we, like i doubt there is two more hours of this game in all seriousness but we got things we can slot in um that's fine we have we have a couple of things in our back pocket don't we sam yeah definitely and I'm not talking about the blow darts um i don't have any blow darts none were given to me by a suspicious train just following instructions Exactly. From the train. No one evil has ever said that. Uh, the conductor I, and I will will drive off into the sunset. I love that the train's just we in love with the conductor. We will each other for all of time. As happily the ever is after. in love with the train. Yeah. It's <sighs> kind of beautiful. It's kind of beautiful. Um, um, yeah, no, this has been a real blast. Um, uh until next week um you can always catch up on uh previous streams um at youtube.com slash at kofi um and you can catch us on twitter at kofi Asam. at kofi Asam. um you can catch me on twitter and on tumblr at neither a baron it's a long story um and you at uh, at Corfidius um, on Twitter, I 
Um, yeah. But until next time, it has been a pleasure spending some time with you and trying to... Um, uh, 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 uh. Trying to solve Sonic's murder. We kind of did, we kind of didn't, but we want to see this play out. Oh, um, yeah. Till next week, people. Have a good one. Um, we'll see you soon. Yeah. Bye-bye.